All right, we're doing the shaded castle. Let's go. There's lots of poison. In fact, since there's so much poison, I'm just going to quickly get the appropriate boluses or whatever the term is, boli. Ah, it's fine. Okay. I wonder if I, yeah, if I two-hand this, I should be able to one-shot them, actually. Let's do that. A jumping attack would definitely do it. Yes. Lovely. It's always the way with enemies that are low to the ground, like these, or like rats, or whatever, or dogs. Easy to miss them with some, some weapons. Alright, way up there? No. Okay. Praise the safe space. Alright. Yeah. Oh, you're still alive? Fucking hell, okay. Right, jumping attacks all the way then. If only I'd upgraded it once more. Anybody up here? Smithing stone fly, okay. It's quite good seeing smithing stones around because it gives you a bit of a rough idea of what sort of level you're supposed to be, or at least what sort of upgrade they're expecting you to be. Oh, bollocks. Rolled in the poison. Yeah, that'll keep um, poisoning you for a while after you roll in it, unless you use soap to wash it off. Most people probably know that by now, but don't roll in the poison, just run through it. And then when you're out, it will stop building up. That's normal. Okay. Like so. Oh, ooh, okay. Basilisks. I do love how they haven't needed to change the Basilisk attack animations since Dark Souls 1. Because they're still just as... <laughs> just as scary when the, the death or curse in previous games starts building up. It's still just as scary as it always was. Come on. Okay. Oh, okay. It says... Ugh. Where you at? No. Thank you. Still haven't been killed by death yet, which is a, a very <laughs> strange sentence. <laughs> um, but when it happens, I don't know if there's... There's probably a unique animation, as in previous games. I'm covered now, aren't I? No? I'm not. Good. It just, it just looks like I am because I did the plunging attack. Wow. Yeah, so we'll see what happens if I do get killed by the uh, the death status effect. We'll see. Expecting it all. I don't know if it'll have a, a lasting effect like Curse did in Dark Souls 1, but I imagine it'll at least have a unique animation. That's the one I killed before. Fine. <laughs> Just got a constant green tint now. Just mess with some RGB sliders. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he was so scared, but he didn't know where it came from, so he just stood still. <laughs> cool. There's some weapons which are not worth two handing, but uh, this is not one of them. Ah, uh, doubt. Yeah, doubt. do actually get boys with this weapon, which is nice. All that was in there? Let me have a look. It seems like there would have been more, more to find there, because there wasn't even any... I don't know. Oh, run, you pillock. Thank you. Dead. 
Yeah. Hidden path not ahead. And yeah, I guess that is it. All right. Oh well, let's go. I have secrets in every area. Oh, one of these guys. Okay. Yeah, I saw a couple of these guys on the way in to this castle, and they're not that hard, but they spam a lot of uh, exploding fire attacks, which can be an issue. Yeah, exactly like this. Let's just run around and try and get the drop on him. Oof. Oof. Nah. Ow. I should probably heal. No. Ah, thank you. Nothing more. So is this the way... Is this the critical path? Possibly. See, there's boys. People are like, ah, boys doesn't exist, it's just like Dark Souls 3. No, it's hyper armor, it works exactly the same way. Let's get some invincibility frames. Oh, fine. Run. Could you not? Could you not? That's so much! <laughs> oh, man. They even get crimson tears. Right, okay, bugger off. Right, deal with this guy. Is he still hitting me from underneath? Oh my lord. <laughs> His attack even clips through geometry. Wow. Not a fan of that. Right, I'm going to leave him there for a minute. Hopefully he gets poisoned. Whoa! Okay! Nice. That's sick. Come on. Yeah, I can't watch up these guys. I may as well just do these. going to spit. Yep. And he's trying to run and grab. Nah, we'll just smack them both. Good. What is that? What hit me there? Is it is it like a lingering hitbox from his poison spew thing? Kind of annoying if it was, because it definitely disappeared visually. Ooh. Uh, trap. 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 No trap. I will be very surprised when I'm going to do this, because it's a one-shot him. Yeah. I do love that weapon art, or Ash of War, however you want to describe it. It makes you very vulnerable for a few seconds, but it's got a lot of hyper armor, and it does a shed load of damage. Ah, oh, he's still here. Alright, mate, I'll just do the same to you. Yeah, it doesn't matter if you jump away, he's still going to get caught. Nice. Hidden path? Not hidden path. Fine. Okay, so this was mostly pointless. Do like that. Okay, let's run through. I'm going to bother killing these slugs because they don't tend to drop anything. Interesting. What's this? Beast bird. Okay. You. Uh, nope. Anything? Anything? Oh, down there? Oh, plants. Nah. Anything gonna drop down? No. Good. Neutral inverters. Yes. Thank you, yes, I agree. Yeah, that seems to be a recurring pattern, even more so than in previous Souls games, like when when you're in an area that is going to require a particular item to get rid of a certain status effect, they will usually give some in an early part of the level, just to leave you under, <laughs> under no illusions as to what you're going to be facing, so I'm assuming... ooh, gosh. I'm assuming that the poison... Oh, so it lingers on the ground. That's what it. That's why it hit me. Okay, I was just being blind. Cool, that's gone now. Um, but yeah, so I'm assuming that the poison is not just going to be in this courtyard and there's going to be more when I get in the actual tower. But you did not jump out at me, which is surprising. Anything? Nothing? something 
something ahead. Oh, is this an alternate way in? This is an alternate way in. Okay. Good to know. Kind of pointless, but good to know. Oh, no. Does that hurt them? Oh, Some enemies are immune to other enemy attacks. That's kind of frustrating. No. Uh, no, thank you. I say no. I say no. I do not consent. Okay. Now you're just doing that. Is that just regular old poison? No, that is Scarlet Rot. Okay. Yeah. Um, there's several other little ones as well. Oh, I could get in there and do my weapon art if he stops being a bastard. But, hmm. Is there even anything... Ah, oh, there's an item, isn't there? Yeah. I mean, it's not a purple item, so it's not going to be something like a sword or a really rare item. But it could be some good smithing stones, in which case I should probably go for it. Ah, sod it. Yeet! It's always nice when it sets them on fire. Right, let's just do one of these. Yeah, and another. Yes. Good. Alright, he's doing the rot. Ugh. Run. Okay, get some of this back. It's not going to reach me here, is it? No. Good. Right, let's wait for that to disperse. And then we run in and just do a few regular hits. That should finish him off. Oh, can you stop doing it as well, little ones? Right, this should be about to go. Yes, okay. Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! Good. It was killed. Get the little ones. Nice. Oh, I can survive a little bit of that. Die! Beautiful. What do we get? Smithing stone! Okay, just as we anticipated. Fine. Eh, not really worth it, but fine. Okay, so I've run around the perimeter. Now I actually want to find the way in to the castle, because there does not seem to be much out here. In... Oh, there's an item. Probably another smithing stone. Ooh. Oh, no, not one of you. Ugh, no, run. Run. Ugh, my least favourite enemy in the entire game. Oh god, he can actually arrive just right next to me as well. Run, run, run! Run, run. I'll stand these guys. Right, up. Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? Okay. Come on, finish it! Oh no! It's gonna reappear. Reappear. Yeah, fine, fine, fine. Okay. Die. Thank you. Thank the Lord. Okay, poisoned. I do not mind that in the slightest. Let's go here and then use a bolus. Oop. Done. Okay. Yeah, when you can kite those guys around geometry, they're slightly easier to deal with, but still. Ugh. I swear that the trailer made them look so much less threatening, like the only time you see them in the trailer it's like a player in a catacomb somewhere and just blocks one of their attacks and immediately does a guard counter. He, he doesn't even block it with a shield, he just blocks it with a two-handed greatsword or whatever, and then immediately does a, <laughs> a guard counter and I'm like, yeah, that's never happening <laughs> with this enemy in-game because they just go absolute ham on you. They just like spam attacks left, right, and centre. It is not fun in the slightest. So, yeah. So, okay. Where did I actually come from? Did I? Oh, is that where I started? The grace over there? No. Did I come from around there? Oh, I did. I must have gone around. Oh, I probably missed a couple of bits there, but stop it. Okay. Smack. Smack. Another. Another. Oh, yes, another. Oh, really? 
interesting that I can target him through that. Weird. You wave left and then right. Okay. Come at me, bro. Bounce. No. Okay. All right. Okay. Fine. Good. Uh, I can probably two-hand again unless another of those bastards comes up. Any more? Any more? Okay. Several. Oh, so nearly one shot. It's nice you can do like a crouch poke like this with this weapon, which comes out quite quickly actually. Crouch poke. <laughs> it's the same as like the rolling attack, I believe. Yeah. Except it comes out a bit quicker. Smack. Then it's quite a lot of really slow weapons seem to have faster crouching attacks, so it's a it's a legitimate tactic. Oh, this is a Valkyrie. No, it's a legitimate tactic to actually use crouch attacks in the middle of combat, particularly in PvP, to catch people out with your timings. Uh, oh, okay. Ah, oh, shit, they're coming up. Okay, get the, get, the, get the shield, get the shield, get the shield. Fine. Okay, oh, that's fine. If you are guard counter abusable, then you are just wrecked, mate. Come on. Nah. Wow. Poke. <laughs> oh, that's fine. I fought these guys before. In Caleb, I think they were even harder there, so... That is fine. Beware of you looking away. What do you mean? Well, just because there's so many statues. Uh... Sure what that message means. Oh, because they're weeping angels. Oh, very good. Very good. I like. It's prosthesis. Ooh, okay. What is that? Oh, okay. So, a, a lord of the Shaded Castle, the lord of the Shaded Castle, embraced this prosthesis even though it is typically made for Valkyries, which, in our classic understanding of Valkyries, would all be females. So, hmm. Much lore. It's fine. So, that's where we came in. Let's run up here. Two. Yes. Oh, miss. Fine. Another. Fine. I jump off here? Yes, I can. Ooh, you're a bit stronger. No door ahead. Okay. Where are we behind? Well, would that be if I hadn't killed all of them, they'd just get up and attack you? Okay. That's why you're clear. Okay, let's drop down. Could do with a grace soon. It's starting to get a bit low on heals. If I drop down, there is a way back up at the roofs, that's fine. Anyway, in here. Oh, okay. One of those horseback cleric things. Um, let's just sneak around here and deal with the individual ones first. He's going to come back, isn't he? Has he seen me? Oh, he has seen me, but he's not doing anything about it yet. Right, let's deal with you. The other one's seen me? No. Right, go into this wooden thing and kill this one. There. Oof. Oh, crouching through poison. Nothing worse. Uh, you right there, buddy? You okay? 
You having you having a good time there? Well, I suppose if you have four arms, you may as well make use of them. Flipping heck. Is he going to look? Is he going to see? No, you are blind. Hello. <laughs> Bless him. He just wanted to be left alone in the corner, just to... Having a bit of fun with his forearms. Wait for the horsey guy to go away, and then we run and smack this guy, like so. And we get out of the poison before we get poisoned. Around here... Alright, horsey guy, come at me. Oh, I'm going to get poisoned, that's okay. Uh, is there anything up here, actually? Because if I can kite him up here, that would be a slightly nicer place to fight. Just these little guys, that's fine. No. Damn it, that's, that's quite a lot. Okay. No, you're not getting one of those up on me. Right, now let's get rid of the poison. Okay, well another horse guy up there. Oh, okay, he's over the fence. It's fine. Uh, go away. Got him. It's fine. Alright, come on. Come at me, bro. Well, you were completely pointless. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that... That mist that certain enemies can let off, it's just... Like, yeah, it obscures your vision slightly, but it's completely pointless. It's completely, like, non-lethal. If it, if it was the kind of thing where it actually interrupted your lock-on and meant that you couldn't lock on to enemies in the, in the mist, that would be a different story. Like, that would actually be... It would, it would mean it had a mechanic for you to deal with. But as it is, it's just, like, there's no problem with things being obscured in the mist because typically they're only little mobs which... You, you know, you can just lock onto, and yeah, sure, you can't see their attack wind-ups, but typically those aren't something you need to worry about anyway, so, I don't know. Go so right and then try surprise attack. Okay. Ah! Can I try surprise attack? He seems to be facing me. Um, oh god, okay, there's a couple of these guys here. Ooh, could I hit them? Could I hit them both with the with the big sweep. Possibly. Let's try. Yes. What? Neither of them? How? Do they have iframes? What? What was that? <sighs> That's an Oh, and he's coming now as well. Shit. Come on. I'm just going to deal with you. Come on. Yeah, that's it. Jump away. That's it. Have some of that. Right. Right, come at me. Both of them. Oh, they're... Have they de-aggroed? Oh, if they de I'm so taking advantage. Oh, that <laughs> spoke too soon. <laughs> oh, Lord. Could you, could you just actually come and attack me? And then we roll, because he's going to do that. Yes, fine. Okay, I think they only have one heal, so I'm not too fussed about that. Spammy bastards. Right, let's just... There's that poison cloud. That is a poison cloud. Good to know pyromancy still works the same. Ugh. Come on. No. No. Yes. Done. So much damage! Depraved Perfumer! Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go with a yes on that. Nothing stone, okay. Please give me a grace! Right, I'm on too low HP. I'm going to have one of these. And then one of these. Okay. Oh, can I kick? Okay. Yes, okay, so, and that goes back to the grace. Okay, fine. 
So we don't get another grace, we just get a shortcut. That's okay, I can live with that. Nice, another perfume bottle. Um, ah, do I go and rest? I would only have to run past this one guy. Yeah, I think I'm going to do it. Let's do it. The ladder is up here, yes. Mm, here yeah, it's annoying that one R1 uh, does not one shot them. But it's okay. Right, that's cool. Oh. Come on, climb it! Don't hit me. Don't hit me, I swear to god, yeah, okay, hit the wall. Good. Bastard. Right, we crouch. <laughs> Very sneaky. Very sneaky. Right, let's go. Good, so that was the way back, and now we go the way forwards. Oh, can I jump up there actually? Yeah, probably. Yes! Oh, but I can't jump up here. Well! <laughs> Rip. Never mind. and run past. That's pointless because I can get up here any time, that's fine. Anything around here? No. Just gonna ignore these guys, they're quite slow. Okay. And then horseman. Oh <laughs> god. Is he coming? He's not aggroed, okay fine. Try this ladder first. Avoid dealing with that as long as I can. Put it ahead. Oh, oh, there was a crate. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Fine. Then what's the point of linking back to the other crates if we were just going to have a new one here? I don't know. I don't understand. That's where I was, yes, that rampart, that's fine, so I've done that. Now is this the main way forward, and then that other bit is just optional, or is that come out here? Ooh, be wary of, right? Yes. Oh, gosh. Doggy! Hi. Die. Come on, dog. Horse. Uh. House Marai is ruined. Marius. Just deserts. We're falling for that severed harpy. Oh, okay. No surprise that Guilty Gretchen took the castle and our storied sword. What sword? I want the sword. If it's Valkyrie related, then it might be a faith sword, which I like. Because faith and dex. Unless I'm forgetting something, Faith and Dex was not really a build in previous Souls games, whereas it is here, which is quite refreshing, which is what I'm going for. In fact, this sword, the God Slayer's Great Sword, is actually Faith and Dex, which is quite nice. It's nice that you get like a, an Ultra Great Sword or a Colossal Sword, as they're called in Elden Ring, but one that scales off Dex. Because before, without infusions, you didn't really have those. Well, I suppose you, you had some, just not. wasn't really a common build. And I do the thing. I would like to do the thing. I'm doing the thing. And to do another thing. Yes! Good. Praise the hyper armor. Yep. Yeah. Okay, and again. Good. Oh, I'm very pleased about that. I'm very pleased. I got sod all for it, but oh well. I got to confirm that the weapon art does one-shot those things if I can get both halves of it off. Good.
level up. Maybe. No. 4,200 and a bit. Like that. Uh, 6,000. Two of them. Oh no. 3,200. Okay, so if I do one more of them, I'll have enough. Yes. Trying to get to 50 faith because I've got an incantation that I really do want to try. Dog aggro? Dog no aggro. Fine. Oh. Dog has aggroed. Ah, well. And so you learn to climb ladders, you're going to be very disappointed, I'm afraid, my friend. Ooh. Okay, your buddies are up here. They can do it for you. Fine. I want you to do it. Okay. Yes, be wary of enemy right. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> he was waiting there <laughs> for seven years for his perfect opportunity to strike. He heard footsteps outside and he got very excited. Poor guy. Let's get a lantern on. Enemy? Yeah. Oh, it's one of these page boys. That's fine. Oof. I like that that hit me behind my shield, but fine, take it, I guess. Ooh, that was close. Oh, can you imagine if I died to one of these guys? That would be very sad. Pickle, yes. Oh, okay. I'll take your word for it. I'm just gonna check I've not missed anything. This feels like the kind of encounter where like a gargoyle is going to just appear out of the sky and just jump down and start attacking me. So I just wipe in my glasses. There we go. I can see. No horse ahead. Okay. No horse ahead. Does that mean that this perfumer's cookbook thing has a recipe to knock people off their mounts? I would be so happy if that's the case. Perfumous cookbook, what was it? Three and poison spray miss blood boil aromatic. That. Use FP to enter a temporary state of fervor. Oh, that's what those other depraved perfumers were doing. Right. So presumably it just gives you an attack boost. I guess. Okay. Poison spray mist, yep, standard. Oh, that's what they were doing, that's why they sprayed poison everywhere. Okay. So they have their attacks, but they also have some of those perfume things. Now, okay, so there's a message there, so you can get up there. I wonder how, though. That seems very unlikely. To me, a jump. Maybe you can. Maybe there's a hidden ladder. Full damage? Full damage, probably. Ah, uh, mistake. No mistake. Okay, full damage is really not very punishing, like. For a lot of falls that, based on previous FromSoft games, you would imagine would be quite a lot of damage. Okay, right. It's one of those Halo Scythe guys. Fine. Come on. No. Do not like that. Okay, that's right. That's fine. Hit me once, and then you're dead. Cool. And then we use one of these. Good. Fine. Perfectly happy to tank like poison build-ups like that if I have the item to get rid of it. Yeah, there's no horse anywhere, what are you talking about? Left and be wary of archer. Uh, okay, so there's a guy there, and then there's an archer above. Okay, well I'm going to leave him there, and I'm going to run up and get the archer. Yes. Good. Now, this guy. 
Doink. Sweet. That's not worth. Yeah, definitely bait. Not enemies, not enemies. Okay, enemy, enemy, enemy. Enemy, yes. You are correct, sir. Is that aggro him? Yes, that aggroed him. Okay, dog there. Mm. Fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. We can deal with this guy. Come on, hit me. Oi, not like that! Oh no, I got the dog. Get it, get it, yes. Okay, good. At least now I've got the iframes and then I can deal with dogs. Fuck. Nope. Oh, stronger dogs as well. Right, run inside, run inside. And they say can't run away. Oh, only one stronger dog. Good, that's fine then. Come here. No. Ooh, spoke too soon about the boys. There we go. Good. on five. I don't do kick. It's a kick. Where is this? Oh, okay. Oh, and this would this be? That's about the same distance. Now it's probably still closer to that second grace, to be honest. But it's nice that we still have that. Good old FromSoft looping level design. Do love it. <laughs> I love seeing the phantoms just like, my people need me. <laughs> just riding the elevator. Uh, still haven't found an elevator where you can drop down yet. And this appears to be no different. Oh well. So are we mostly done this castle? Okay, so we go up there, there's a bit to that tower there, and then... Oh, actually, so yeah, we must be able to jump off to get onto that bit there, presumably. Um, and then through and a bit of that tower, and then, then we're done, then that's this area. Okay. So can we jump off in this direction? No. Illusory wall. Hmm. I'll check that on the way back. Okay. Yeah, boss encounter. Here, oh here. Oh, I see. That's the stake of Marika. Oh, very good. Very good. Okay. Hmm. Uh, I'm quickly going to check. Well, actually, I, I can't check the wall, can I? Because I'm too far away from it. Ah, uh, it's probably nothing. Right, so this is the boss, and then presumably... We can go up the tower and loot something on the roof. Ah, so I've not got many runes. Let's just go. Oh, okay, one of these guys. Nice. Sweet. Ow, less sweet. He'll, yeah, he's going to hit me with that. It's fine. All right, come on, smack me. Mm. Fine. Okay. Right, so the shoulder bash, we can probably afford to get a shield, the guard counter off on. Ah, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, okay. That's a three attack. Fine. Fine. Take America, please. Yes. Good. All right. Well, I fought one of these guys before, and he was... Obviously, this guy's scaled up considerably from that, but... Should not be too bad. I'll, I'll give it another go with this sword, and... If I'm struggling with the speed of attacks, I'll probably change to my flail. Read, fetch my flail. Yeah, two and then three. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, mistake, mistake. How about good? Fine. Okay, so when he does a charge, that's a that's a dark hand. Yeah, fine. I get one hit. Ah. Not quite block again in time. That is annoying. It's 
because it's quite slow. Okay. Yeah. Smack. Dead. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So that has a good bit of range to it, so we just need to dodge at the right time, not try and hitbox it. Fine. All right. One more time with this sword. And then we go to the boss killer setup. <laughs> That's nice. Ah, he's doing that. Okay. Follow up? No follow up. And then poke. Yeah, and then we drink. Fine, he's going to do shield. Okay, shoulder bash. Fine. Should have done something about that. Okay. Ah, mistake doing a heavy there. I was trying to get the guard counter off. So it's too late. Yeah, do that. And then we dodged through it. Cool. Okay, he does a finish up. Mm, shouldn't have done the heavy. Yeah. Uh, it's because I'm getting, yeah, I'm mistiming the attacks thinking I'm going to get a guard counter when I haven't actually been hit. I probably can do it with this sword, but just because I'm a scrub who has no patience, I'm going to swap to the flail. And then we'll just bleed him to death. Right, let's go even more. Some of this. Right. Go even more try hard on it. Nope. Okay. I was blocking! Ugh. The timings on these attacks seem very calculated to be able to hit you still when you're in the middle of a recovery animation which is doesn't feel great yeah oh really you oh for heaven's sake wow i have now died to this guy more than i died to godric <laughs> oh man yeah i really should level vitality but i just can't bring myself to do it i'm just like i want the faith i want the dexterity i want to be able to use the cool things means that most enemies can one-shot me, or two-shot me, and then get it back. Yeah, good. Two, and then smack, and then we get, oh, not a fourth. Oh, I did block it, okay. Nope. Smack. Ow. Don't. Don't. Dodge, dodge into it. Oh, I forgot he does the follow-up at the end. Nope. Drink. Don't hit me. <sighs> no. Can't get that far, surely. No, okay. Alright. Fine. Oh. into it good and then we get that and then we, yeah block good okay fine and then he's gonna do a second yeah yeah and then cool we can block that good oh nope. shouldn't have done the second Ooh. very nearly finished me off oh but just the fourth but we can block it okay good 
when it's a fast guard counter, like with this weapon, we can block it. We can block the force. Good. Don't hit me out of this. I need some stamina, please. Good. Sometimes he only does a one, which is a bit annoying. Come on, get the blade off, please. Only one. Yeah, it's kind of a problem. Oh, we can only do one attack at a time. The timings seem very tight. One, and then we block. Oh, he didn't do the follow-up that time. How strange. Yeah. Hit him. Yes, bleed. Oof. Drink. No. Yep. Yeah. Okay, he didn't do the follow-up, but I didn't get the guard count, so that's fine. Follow-up? Yes. Good. Two, and then three, and then four? No. Nope. Okay. Mistake. Yeah, that was a mistake. I left the guard counter way too late. That's so annoying. That's so annoying. I thought he was going to go for a follow-up. All right. All right. I'm getting this slowly. That's fine. That was very nearly it. I think I've actually died to him more than to Astol <laughs> now. <laughs> that void monstrosity. Which, uh, I mean, that just goes to show, doesn't it? Like... Different bosses give different people vastly different amounts of trouble. Like, for whatever reason, this guy is proving an issue for me. But it's just how it goes sometimes. Nope. Yeah, mistake. I can do that thing, but I can dodge away from it and get health back. Good. Nope. For fuck's sake. When it, okay, when he starts with the. This, oof, no, no, don't do the heavy. That's it, okay. Yeah, so when he starts with the poke, we do not punish. Fine. Do the spin? Yep. Good. Oh, only one. Two and then three. Yep. Good. Four. Does that, but we block it. Yes. Okay. Heal here. No, we cannot. No. Oh, you bastard! I hate it when you get locked in this loop of just healing and then immediately getting hit out of the heal. It's exactly like that. What? What? No, thank you. I'm going to have lost all of my bleed build up now. Alright, and then two. Yeah. Fine. I was blocking that, you twat. No. Dead. Oh, man. You know when you feel like you're decent at a game <laughs> and then some random dude with a red sword comes along and goes nope this is <laughs> this is not dark souls but this is dark souls prepare to die <sighs> yeah behind fine fine Oh! So early. And do the sweep, that's fine. I don't mind that at all. 
fine. I should dodge through that because I could probably get a hit off. Good. Good. Smack. Yes! Okay, good. Yeah, so if we can get him down, he is absolutely manageable from that. Two, and then three. Oh, he's done the fourth. Yep. Fine. Come on. Good. Yeah, I need to dodge through that. Okay, so if he ends with the poke, that, ooh, that was only just in time. Likewise, it ends with that. Yep. Nice. Get him down. Yes. Okay. I can probably get a jump on him. Yeah. At least he doesn't have a phase two. Flipping it. Run around him. Good. One smack. Don't get greedy. Too far to get greedy on him now. One more. Dead. Sometimes you just get in a rhythm with bosses. And, yeah. They just get... They, be they become so much less of a problem. Wow. Executioner Sword Briar, great shield. Right, let's have a look at that sword. Is that just a great sword? Yes, it is. Oh, of course, being, yeah, blood, it's arcane. Ah, oh, strength and arcane as well, goodness. Storied sword of House Murray, the family of executioners who presided over the Shaded Castle. I suppose this does actually look like an executioner's sword, yep. Yeah. One of the legendary armaments. Oh, very cool. Elmer of the Briar, the bell-bearing hunter, snatched the sword from the sight of his looming execution and furnished it with battle skills from his home of Iid, or however you pronounce it. Use the sword with energy and then fling it forward in a corkscrew attack. Nice, okay, so you can do that and you can charge it to make it go further. Very cool. But if I'm ever doing a uh, an arcane build, I will know where to come. Anything else up here? Praise the night. Lovable sort of head. Angel. What's that? Ah. Okay. So, is there a way out up the top here? Because this is not the entire fort. Hmm. That is not the entire height of it. And there was definitely souls to get runes. I did not get many runes for killing him. Maybe I'm overleveled then. Oh, you can hit this. Yeah, nothing. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> no, thank you! Go on, step, go on, go on. Fall down the hole, fall down the hole. Yes! <laughs> oh, gravity. <laughs> okay. So we got up there, we didn't get up there, but there doesn't seem to be anything up there anyway, so I don't know if there's any point. Oh, I haven't got up there. Is this it? I mean, I don't want to complain because there's a decent boss fight and a decent weapon out of it, even if I can't use it, but... Hmm. It was a legendary weapon, so probably important, but... Would have thought that there would be a way up to the roof. Have another quick look down around the bottom of there to see if there's a ladder I missed or anything. Uh... Also, the fact that there seems to be a like a wooden bridge over to the next turret above here that sort of seems like something that would be. Scalable. I don't know. Right. Sure. Good.
Hmm. Nothing there other than butterflies. Maybe that is it. Maybe there isn't anything on top of there. Because I can't get to the top of that turret. It's just weird that the way they've designed that turret, it almost seems like you could walk over the top of that bridge. Unless you can jump from that roof. Is there a way up to this roof? Stop. Oh. No. Thank you. God, the blood effect is so over the top. Rump ahead. No. I refuse. Hmm. Accidental parkour. Lead. Thank you. I think that is probably everything then. Let's just quickly go out here and make sure there's no way up to this roof. Ah, oh, bollocks. Ow. Ah, it stopped locking it exactly the wrong time. Nope. Good. Excellent. What did you drop? Did you drop the scythe? Ooh, clean hot helm. Ooh, we like that. Oh, that's a pity. It's not as good as what I'm wearing, but let's have a look. It doesn't really go with this armor set either. Yeah. Let's see. Let's let's fashion souls this a bit. What does this go with? It goes okay with that. Probably goes better with. The, mm, I don't know. Goes better with the Landel armor than the Gelmir armor, just because of the how bright the bronze is on it. Let's see, no. Oh, it goes quite well with the twin armor actually. That's not bad. Let's see. Mm. Mm. It's just how vibrant the helmet is. It means it's not going with. A lot of what I've got. That, that doesn't look bad actually, but it's a lot lighter. Mm. I mean, it doesn't look awful with Red Redan's set, but now nah, we'll stick with the hell. Okay, right, well, I'm going to call it in that case. I think that that is pretty much everything for Shaded Castle. <laughs>